Hey Millbridge friends, I've got another cool experiment for you to do that is really fun to do in the spring. We're going to be making a homemade bird feeder that is organic and safe. Um, so I'm going to show you what you're going to need. Yoshi says hello. He likes to watch me do stuff outside while I'm out here. So um, we'll get started. So the first thing you're going to need is a piece of twine. This is what we're going to be using to hang our bird feeder. A spoon, knife, butter knife, nothing fancy, pencil, an orange or you can use a grapefruit. Grapefruit is even better because they're bigger. And then bird seed. Okay. So I am going to turn my table just a little to kind of walk you through this. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to cut my orange in half. You may need to get some help from your parents on this, but as you can see, you can do it with just a plain uh, butter knife. Okay. Looks like my paper towel blew away. Okay, so the next thing you're going to do, you're going to empty out all of the inside of the orange. So I'm just going to use a spoon. Take this all out. Make sure you got some paper towels handy because this is messy. The sugar that is in the oranges is naturally very, very sticky. The really fun part is getting to eat this. Okay, so here we go. This is what you're left with. Now, put this aside and eat it later because it's really good for you. Okay, so what we're going to do next, I'm going to take my pencil and I'm going to make the holes for our twine to hang our, um, our feeder with. So I'm going to come down to, you know, right about here, about a half an inch below the edge, right where the, um, this little knot was up here. And I'm just going to poke a little hole in it like that. Okay. Do the same thing over here. Little hole. Then I'm going to take my twine and I'm going to feed it through the orange just like that and I'm gonna tie it off I would double knot this okay and I'm gonna do the same thing to the other side I'm just gonna take the end thread it through that little hole that I made Now this is not going to last forever, obviously, but it will naturally degrade and that's okay. That's why we're making it out of uh, natural materials. So here's what we've got so far. So we've got it tied off, we've got it cleaned out. Um, and so next we are going to add our bird seed. So it takes about, I don't know, maybe three quarters of a cup of bird seed. Definitely do this activity outside because you're going to get bird seed everywhere. So this is what we've got. It is ready to hang in a tree and um, it will decompose and break apart just like nature intended. So um, let's go find a tree to hang it in. All right. This is one of my favorite trees, so we're going to hang it here. I'm going to put it right there and I'm going to watch it and um, hopefully we'll see lots of birdies. I've been hearing a lot of them, so I think that we will 
definitely um, have a lot of visitors to this uh, because it is spring and they're having all their babies and everybody is out and about. So I hope you guys are spending some time outside and um, getting some fresh air and going for hikes and um, staying safe. I miss you guys and look, uh, check out the next video for the next experiment. Bye guys. Love you.